My name is Brian Downey. I'm the segment manager for Caterpillar's Asphalt Compactors. Today I'm going to give an overview of the, uh, the new, what's new in our medium asphalt compactors, talk about the technology that's built into them as well. So first thing, um, the CB10, Caterpillar is going through a transition now of changing nomenclature and we're doing that starting with our medium asphalt compactors. So a CB54B is becoming a CB10. The 10 represents the metric tonnage of the machine. Quite simply stated, a CB10 is a 10 ton asphalt compactor. The CB44 becomes the CB7. The CB46 becomes the CB8. The CD44 is going to become the CB8. And the CD54 is going to become the CD10. We introduced the B-Series back in 2013. Uh, had uh, a lot of good operator feedback on the new station, the mini wheel, the controls. We decided to take that a step further and simplify the controls. So now most machines will have an eight button control panel. To improve job site safety, we've added new lighting options. In addition, serviceability of the machine has changed. And so we're providing greater access through larger doors. In addition to our conventional vibratory systems, so traditional vibration with our Versavi 2M2 frequency or 5M system, we're now launching into the oscillation environment. The amplitude and frequency selections of our conventional systems provide great flexibility on some of the tougher and thicker lifts. Now combine this with an optional oscillatory rear drum and we can actually create compassion in the sensitive areas. We're doing this Caterpillar style. On our conventional vibratory pods, we have a three-year, 3,000-hour service interval. On the oscillatory system, we're going to have a two-year, 2,000-hour. This is about double what most of the competitors are in the industry. In addition to this, we're utilizing power transmission belts. So rather than Timing belts, which are commonly used by others, we're using a power transmission belt, and this has about double the life. That combined with the option of a hardened rear drum. So here, here you can see that massaging motion of the oscillatory compared to standard vibration. So this, is, this kind of movement is what actually massages the asphalt, and also creates the wear that I talked about. So a very exciting introduction for Caterpillar into the oscillatory compassion space.